I mean, we've spoken about IBS, IBD. You've told us what it stands for, but what are the key differences between the two? So, IBS is irritable bowel syndrome, which is just a collection of all the gastric discomforts, which is bloating, constipation, either diarrhea or uh, like. Loosies, which people say, and there is also like variations in diarrhea. A lot of times, it's just loose stools, which could be as basic as you're not adding good amount of fiber, or it's just inflammation running in the body, which is IBS, just the collection of all the symptoms. IBD can be way worse, and it is a type of autoimmune condition. That's when your body's cells starts attacking its own cells. Okay, that's why it's called as autoimmune. It's like self-developed. It's a battle between itself. Exactly. So it, it's like it's more like a part. of your body now but it develops over time if you're not again taking care of care of your body if there are a lot of infections coming in the body which you did not tackle at like at the initial stage now which has become a big picture and there are two types of it exactly like the crohn's and the ulcerative colitis the ibd so uh, that is uh, inflammatory bowel disorder and in this you can get explosive diarrhea there can be mucus there can be blood in the stool and people might end up uh, like losing weight a lot there will be severe energy issues brain fog so yeah if you're not if your gut is not healthy you're not dry skin like hair fall everything like all the nutrients are coming out of the body you're not getting anything no absorption is taking exactly. place exactly so ibd is like way worse 